It has never been easier to remove a white background in Photoshop. With Photoshop open, file, open. Locate your image, select, press open. Select the layer with the white background, create a mask. Make sure the mask thumbnail, not the layer thumbnail, is selected. Window, properties. In the properties panel, scroll down, select and mask. Set your view mode to overlay, and in the top bar, select subject. Press OK. Select masked areas, set a highly contrasting color. I'll go with red. Pull up the opacity to 100% so that you can better see the selection. We have four options to further refine this selection. Open refine mode, use color aware refine mode for one color backgrounds, as we have here. Use object aware for more complex backgrounds. Command or control plus to zoom in. Hand tool to locate small areas of white. Come to edge detection, turn on smart radius, select the brush tool, select the minus, select your size and click and drag to remove small areas of white from the image. Command or control zero to come to full screen. Further refine the selection with global refinements. You have four tools to choose from, smoother selection or harsher selection, increase feather or decrease feather, increase contrast or decrease contrast, and lastly, try increasing the edge of your selection or decreasing the edge of your selection. Play around with all four sliders to get the selection just right. Two more options you can try. Under output settings, try decontaminate colors and adjust the amount with the slider. You can also try the refine hair option. Once all adjustments have been made, set output to new layer with layer mask, press OK. Put your selection to the test. Select the layer underneath your new mask layer, click the adjustment layers, add a solid color layer, select a contrasting color, I'll go with red, click OK. If you're still seeing white areas, let's take it to the twilight zone. Select your top layer mask, right click, duplicate layer. Okay, select the layer below the duplicate, set the blend mode to multiply. Click the duplicated mask layer and click the layer mask thumbnail, not the layer thumbnail. With the layer mask selected, select your brush tool. Make sure your foreground color is set to black. If it's not, you can click and select black. Up top, set a soft round brush, an appropriate size. Command or control to zoom in and H for hand tool to click and drag to those specific areas, P for brush tool, and paint over those white areas. Repeat this until all white has been removed, then Command-0 to fit the screen, hold Command or Control, with the top layer selected, select the layer below it, right click, group from layers, let's call this group subject, OK, and there's our subject selection, and then I can toggle the background on or off accordingly. And there you have it. All the white has been removed, and the subject can now be placed on top of any other layer or background. I really hope you found this tutorial helpful, and if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, keep on designing, and I will see you for the next tutorial.